Hi, welcome to today's video. In fact, welcome to my first ever YouTube video. My name is Paul. So today I'm just going to be doing a little bit of charcoal uh, sketching. Um, recently I've been doing a lot of these sort of charcoal still life floral sketches or drawings, um, like the one on the screen. Um, it's using charcoal and a little bit of white Conte pastel. Okay, so as I said, I'm using Arteza paper here. It's not bad paper, it's reasonably priced and sort of medium quality. Um, you don't have to use that, you can use any type of paper really with um, charcoal. Even just newsprint is quite good and it's very cheap. So the charcoal that I'm using, well at the moment you can see it's a charcoal pencil. Um, but I also use some vine charcoal. So the vine charcoal is willow charcoal. Um, again, it's reasonably inexpensive. Um, you can also get compressed charcoal. Some of that tends to be more expensive, I think. Um, the compressed charcoal, they just, they take um, the regular charcoal, they crush it up into a powder and mix it with some sort of binder, put it into a mold and then compress it. So what you get is something that is more, it has a more regular uh, cross section, either circular or square. I also use a bit of white Conte pastel just for some highlights. Um, the Conte pastel is quite hard and brittle, but it's good for adding in some highlights. I don't use any sort of reference here. Um, nor am I using any sort of physical objects. It's all just from imagination. And I think using your imagination is sometimes overlooked. People tend to focus on where can I get reference photographs? Where can I, who can I copy? Things like that. Maybe sometimes just use your imagination and just see what happens. One of my favorite artist. One of my main influences for this type of drawing is a Finnish artist. Her name was Helene Sharvik, um, if that's the correct way of pronouncing it. If you've never come across her paintings, I definitely recommend taking a look. I'll try to put a link down below in the description. Um, but she was a fantastic artist. and One of the best known Finnish artists, but maybe not as well known outside of Finland. So at this point, I'm just adding in squiggles and lines and things and sort of, why am I doing that? Well, why not? <laughs> you know, it's, it's my painting, my drawing, and I just do what I want to do. And if other people like it, that's fantastic. And if they don't, well, that's okay as well. I think the thing is just do what you want to do. Don't feel as though you have to stick to any particular way of doing charcoal drawings. Okay, so that was today's video. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, if you want to subscribe, just click on the subscribe button below, big red button. And beside that, there's the bell icon. If you click on that, I think it will let you know when I'm uploading a new video. Um, I try, I will try to upload several videos a week at first. Um, we'll see how things go. Uh, 